Hi everybody, welcome to George Moore Chevrolet. My name is Sam Martin. I'll be showing you this 2023 Chevrolet uh, LTZ Silverado. For those of you who aren't familiar with the LTZ trim for the Silverado, it's one trim down from high country, which is a high trim. You're going to have a lot of uh, chrome here on the grille, which is going to be one of your biggest giveaways that is an LTZ. Coming around the side of the vehicle, we can see a Z71 badge. This is your off-road package, uh, improved suspension, underbody skid plate. Uh, for protecting the transmission tunnel. Uh, vehicle also has, of course, four-wheel drive, 360 surround camera system or HD surround vision. Blind spot sensors in the mirrors too, which are also power folding. The exterior is a jet black with a black interior. Uh, as I said, the vehicle is four-wheel drive, which means it also is also equipped with a two-speed auto track. Uh, that system will put it into four-wheel drive if it detects any wheel slippage. Power up and power down tailgate. Of course, it is still piston assisted. Like so. As far as the rest of the rear of the vehicle, you have a dual exit exhaust with your rear sensors. It is fully equipped for cameras for uh, any type of trailer you plug in. Of course, equipped for it as well. Spray and bed liner from the factory. And now we're going to go to the vehicle's interior to talk about some of its more interesting features. All right, right now on the inside of our LTZ. We're going to start off at the very top as we usually do. You have a power sliding rear window in this vehicle. If you take a look at the back, opens and closes, of course, from this button right up here. Still equipped with OnStar, so you have anti theft, vehicle recovery, engine kill. You also have right here, as you can see, the active camera mirror. It can be flipped on or off to have a regular mirror or the digital one. Digital settings are fully customizable, so you have, of course, your uh, brightness setting, a zoom setting, and a height setting as well. Down from that, you have the 13.2 inch screen, uh, which is all new to the 2022s and 2023s. 2022s was uh, second half of the production. It's a fully movable display, so you can customize what, you, what it shows. Access it to your camera system, including your 360 surround cameras with a frontal camera and rear camera system. Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. It does run off a Google system, so uh, Google Maps is something that's built into it. Down here, we have our downhill control. Uh, tailgate deploy, auto stop, which can be toggled on or off by simply pressing that button, parking sensors and lane keeping, vehicles also equipped with heated and cooled seats for both passenger and driver, and a uh, trailer braking controller. The dual zone control here, as you can see, is a full digital LCD display. Now, one of the biggest changes is going to be your shifter location. It used to be a column shifter, now it's an electronic center shifter, as you can see there. That to put it in drive. Here to put it in park. Vehicle is equipped with a 10-speed transmission. Frontal display is fully customizable, including the layout. You have a few extra goodies to it being an LTZ. You have both speakers, memory seats, like I said, power folding mirrors too. You are looking at a 5.3 liter V8 Ecotec 3 engine. And also the vehicle is equipped with a heads-up display. So right in front of the driver, you'll be able to see uh, the vehicle speed and uh, a lot of other information, for example, it's RPM, your front collision alert, your heading, and an off-road mode, which shows your tilt, yaw, and if you're in two-wheel uh, two drive or four-wheel drive. Uh, come down to George Moore Chevrolet and see me, Sam Martin. Hopefully, we can have you uh, drive this baby home.